Hello and welcome to Ashley's Corner. So after I posted my first episode, I wasn't really sure what I should talk about for the next episode. And I was on Skype with my boyfriend and I asked him, you know, what he thought I should talk about. And he thought about it for a minute and he said, well, you should talk about how people always say that blondes have more fun and then he paused and was like, oh, you should also talk about how breadheads are crazy. This got me thinking. I was wondering if there was anything that people had to say about people with black hair or brunettes. So I googled hair color stereotypes and found this crazy ass article. And the link is in the description just so you know I didn't just pull this out of my ass or anything. This article actually does exist. And Anyway, the article said that brunettes are typically quiet and book smart and never doing anything wrong. Basically implying that they're like a goody two-shoe almost. And it also said that blondes are ditzy and find everything funny and have a bubbly personality. Use words like, oh my god, and totally, and like a lot. You know, it's people that like constantly, like after every other word, say like, like a whole bunch of times. Like it's really annoying and I freaking can't stand that. And apparently blondes also twirl their hair a lot when they talk. That, I'm, that one just blows my mind. I twirl my hair all the time. Do I have blonde hair? Not currently. I, I don't, I have nothing else to say about that one. Um, so anyway, people with black hair apparently don't give a fuck, are total badasses, and sex is a game to them, and apparently black haired women are tomboys and daredevils. And there was a little bit about redheads too. Apparently they're cool and calm all the time and have no need for hate or anger and are freaks in bed and are crazy and also and this just came out of nowhere it also mentions that redheads like to feel the pain of the needle when they're getting tattooed now that one I was just like where the hell did this person come up with this how do they know only redheads like that the whole article blew my mind. For one, it was written by a woman. I'm just like, how can a woman really sit there and say that if you have this certain hair color, you possess these different personality traits? That's total bullshit. Your hair color has nothing to do with your attitude towards yourself, towards other people. It has nothing to do with your personality. And the second thing that really like threw me off about this whole article was there were several typos. And I don't, I don't know. Um, personally, I proofread everything before I post it on Facebook, YouTube, MySpace, my yearbook, whatever it is. Like homework, I, I proofread that like all the time. And I just didn't understand why she would post something like that about hair color in the first place. Why would you post something about that? That's wasteless space on the internet. And second off, why didn't she proofread it? I'm going through and reading it and I'm like, okay, that's supposed to have an apostrophe. She used the wrong there. Anyway, I'm going totally off topic. Um, hair color. It, it does have does not have anything to do with your personality. I don't care what you say. Not all blondes are ditzy. I'm a natural blonde. I don't consider myself ditzy. I don't consider myself dumb. Yeah, it is fun to play the dumb blonde card sometimes. Just to get a laugh or two. But no, not all blondes are dumb. And people with black hair, I don't see where this 
stereotype of people with black hair are tomboys and daredevils. I mean, I know several people, several girls that played like ball in high school and shit like that, and not one of them had black hair. And then the thing about redheads being chill and calm all the time and having no need for hate and anger, I'm just like, okay, because I know a couple redheads and neither of them really are that chill and calm all the time. One of the redheads I know actually has very bad anger issues and doesn't like most people and is very opinionated and speaks his opinion quite frequently. And then people with brown hair are said to be quiet and, you know, um, what else do the articles say? They, it says that they study like four hours a day. Okay, I don't think your hair color determines how much time you study. I'm just like, what the fuck, people? Really? I, I don't know. And the, the whole article itself, like I said, there are a lot of typos. And it just didn't make sense to me because, as I've said, before, you know, earlier, hair color does not determine attitudes, personality, whatever. It, the, the article, for it to be on the internet, I feel like that's just a waste of space. I mean, I know the internet's not really space confined, but still, it's a waste of time to seriously look at this stuff. I mean, I don't know if people are just looking at it just for fun, just for kicks. And I don't know the woman who wrote it. I don't know if she wrote it for fun or kicks. But people actually do believe in these stereotypes, and it's stupid. They're... I, I don't have anything else to say about this. I'm repeating myself, and I'm just done. So, till next time, bye.